let's go welcome to the next episode of City Skylines. We last left off, we had just expanded Herschel's farm, and we're going to see what happens. And I'm excited because it seems like things are moving very well. I've had a chance to read the comments on the first three episodes. One of the, the major things that may be a little loud here, so let me just do a little adjustment here for the kids. Um, one of the things you said, hey, Dan, check your policies because you're getting gashed here in the policies arena. And where are the policies? I thought there's something. That's education. I thought there was a policies thing. Apparently not. So, is it here? I thought we could control that. Either way, okay, so there's Steve one The other thing that was commented on multiple, multiple, I would say multiple, but ECG Bauer made it known in a couple videos that, hey, Dan, it's probably not in your best interest to have your sewage plant in still water. And while I don't know why, I, I do believe that I am not being trolled here. So what I do want to see is I do want to see where we should put this. He said put it down stream and that makes sense to me because you want it to go into other people's cities not yours so we're gonna move this it's maybe a little costly but let's go ahead and move our water drain pipe how much does that cost 500 that's not bad at all so let's go ahead and put it here and I, I feel like that's a a fair placement and a fair tip which isn't spoiler just looking out for the the betterment of uh, Danbury Heights so the only other issue is we are going to have to get some power. How much is one of these? No, thank you. We'll just we can do this for right now. Yeah, it's 2200. Ouch. Now, do we spend, see this is how we get ourselves in a little trouble. Do we spend the monies? We're definitely going to have to pipe this off. So let's go ahead and pipe that. Now the question is, do we build one of these for six grand? If we're gonna build a power line, that's gonna cost two grand. Let's see what the wind's like over here. Ooh, it's fairly strong. I'm okay with it. Let's put it there. That's ah, gonna hurt us though. Uh, this could be a bad fiscal decision. Let's not do it. Let's just we'll just bite the bullet, I guess. It's okay. Hey, we're gonna. This is for the the long term growth. We can always do a shorter one. Twenty two four. Man, I feel like placing this is the right move. I just don't want to put us in dire straits here. We don't have enough for that yet. Do we want to do it? Six grand. All right, let's make a decision. And go with it. This is the better fiscal decision. It's it's gonna cost us in the long run but in the short run we're going to be okay is that space already occupied what about from here there we go there we go all right so hopefully this satisfies our needs let's go ahead and see what happens we have an issue going on here what's going on right here boys a dead person is waiting for transport okay so this is our first death situation I look, go right to incinerator. Okay, so we need to buy a cemetery. So that makes sense. We're going to build a cemetery somewhere. We're going to have to take a loan to do that. We're going to take a smart loan. So we could take a loan of 20 G's. That costs us 408 a month. 52 weeks. This is better for cash flow. It's much better for cash flow. This gets paid down a lot sooner. I think we're going to... I just don't want us to give us a false sense of of stuff here. This is clearly the better play. If the interest rate's better, let's take the short-term loan right now. Let's go ahead and build ourselves a nice graveyard. Now, where do we want to put the graveyard? Because we don't want to put it in the, the center regions. We could put it near Herschel's farm. Eight grand. We also have to worry about traffic. You know what we could do? Why don't we do this? What if we just extended another row ad? 
just a little bit. I would like to do this. Uh, we don't want curvature, we just want straight. Why is that not giving us straightness? What if, oh, because we have to go around that, huh? So let's go take this extended just a little bit more. We just want to go straight down. What's a guy got to do to have a straight road? Why? Why, why, why? Okay, for whatever reason, they want us to have a curved road. Now can we go straight? There we go. All right, so we just wanted to give ourselves a place where we can connect the dots and just put the yield dead bodies here. Place roadside. That is roadside. Oh, that's not a road. That's a highway. Okay, okay, okay. I got you. I got you. So let's go ahead and we want it somewhere near the powered area, though. This is getting a little bit away from us, but that's okay. We were just to do that. Make another little... See, the only thing is that's avoiding the loop. That's okay. We'll deal with it. So here, we're going to extend a road here. For right now. And we're going to put the incinerator for dead people right here. Yeah, put it right there. Okay. So that made people happy. No more urns on the mantelpiece. The new cemetery is open. Good. Okay, so we're in a good position now. That needs some power and water. I would think the power should be there, but it's just a little too far away. So we'll go ahead and extend this pipe right there. And I think we have power now, boys. Okay, that's good. That's good. That kind of looks like that belongs in Herschel's farm. Either way, let's get things going. Uh, why is there no water here? There's just a little bit of trolldom, that's why. So let's extend this pipe, like so, to get full coverage. Michonne Sliver, by the way, there was a funny joke, I believe, in episode 3 in the comments regarding Michonne Sliver that I will not repeat, because I don't want to say it's it's for the kids, kind of, but n not really, that's why I'm not going to say it, but it was still creative, I'll, I'll give you daps on that, but anyways, see if the, is this dead body gone? How do we get that dead body there? Who transports that? Is there a hearse? Hearse in use. Operating norm normally. Cemeteries in final resting place. Good. Is, can they get there? That's a one way. So they can't get there. Okay, that's... A, they can get there, they can't get out. Hmm. So we want this road to be... Two way. Cannot upgrade this to two way road, okay. So they're going to need just a straight line back, I guess. We'll go. It's still a one way, though. That's the problem. Ooh, we're going to lose part of Herschel's farm. Hmm, how do we get them back? Actually, we could just do this, right? Connect here to here. There we go. There goes the hearse. It has pr traffic. I love that the game actually works like that. Like, that was clearly a, a blunder on my traffic mistakes. But I like that it doesn't penalize you. Ooh. Our first evidence of traffic problems. Okay, why is that? Because this is a main deal here. So what if we made another offshoot? Maybe from there to there to give people another shot. Let's see if we can do that. This is highway, correct? It is. Yeah, I don't really... That's not a smart deal. Who should I call if no one shows up to pick up the dead? Eh, you're not funny. All right, let's do a rounded road here. Space already occupied. So we're going to have to go... 
Ah, come on. How is that occupied? Four grand for that. Hmm. I don't know if that's worth it. But we could do, what if we did a raised road? See if this is going to work. No, it's not. Oh, it is. Ooh, this could be our first raised action. We could take this wherever the heck we want it. So let's do this. Let's get creative here. And hopefully this doesn't... Where we encounter problems. So say we were to do this. But how does that alleviate the pressure there? Cross over? That's something for the future. Let's just not worry about that for right now. Because I feel like we don't want to get ourselves in a situation where we're fighting the budget books. Because we don't want to be fighting the, the budget books. Speaking of budget books, let's see where we're at here. Bringing in eight grand, spending 7,700. Let's do a little tampering here where we're spending a lot of money. A lot of money in education, a lot of money in power. Where's our power at right now? Okay, we need that money and that power. Money, power, respect. What you eat in life. There's nothing really we can uh, cut that a little bit. I don't want to raise taxes yet, do we? Let's just see if we can get by here through this growth period. There's a fire going on here. Dead body situations taken care of. Traffic's pretty good except for right... Ooh. You know what, that's just gonna have to happen. Let's see if they wanna get here. Where are these guys going? Some of these guys just did a full on loop. Okay, these guys, how come no one's picking them up? Dead person is waiting for transport. Not enough workers. Okay. So if we need to construct some more homes, this looks like a fresh area to do so. Because look at this wasted space. But then it brings in more traffic. So many tough decisions to make here. What if we were to do a little... We've got to save this for future expansion to get here. Oh, we said we weren't going to add any more residential over here. I'm okay with that. What are these hearses? What are you guys doing? Where's dead body? Is there a dead bodies thing here? Crime. How's there not a dead? Health. Where's health? Health. Death care. Where are the death care mobiles at? Huh. All right, well, we're learning here. So what we did say, we said we weren't going to expand any more residential on this side. So what we can do is put it over here. We're going to continue to leave this for residentialness. This is a one way in, and to get out, they've got to go back that way, which isn't necessarily a great thing. Because we've got to find a way to get these people back to the loop. And I guess you could circle back through here. So let's just we put a two lane here. Ah. A dead person is waiting for transport. Make sure there are enough hearses that they can reach the building. Crematorium availability. Do we need a crematorium? No, just bury it. You don't have to have that. Get that out of here. Alright, so maybe the budget? Is there budget issues with that? Yeah. We have a little bit to play with. There we go. Okay, so we still have another loop issue. So if you wanted to get back, if you're coming here, you could loop back here. Can we do a, just a simple road? Oh, we gotta destroy someone to do that. And that also slows down this nice flowing traffic. So realistically, we need some sort of a loop back this way. 
I will try it. Well, let's not worry. I just don't want to worry about traffic right now. We've got to focus on expansion, right? <laughs> but the thing is, I'm so neurotic. We've got to develop a new offshoot here. So let's get a two-piece. Where do we want to put uh, the next residential area? Right here. So let's go ahead and... How much money? We have 11. Let's take it to about 2,400. And then let's do just some single road offshoots. This is going to be a simple area. These people are not going to be happy about living near the highway, but that's okay. Actually, let's develop down this way first. Got to make tough decisions as the mayor of Danbury. And, ah, it's a little overlap. One more. So yeah, that, that killer, having that space in the middle just, just slaughters me. It's okay, though. We're just going to make this a nice little, little offshoot. And see, oh, we got power issues. There's a new piece of land available for purchase. We're not interested in that just yet. We're trying to become fiscally responsible here. Alright, so these people are having garbage issues, and why is no one moving there? Um, do we need to work on our garbage funding? Yep, that's got to go way up. We're going 150%, boys. Where is our... Ooh, they've got a long way to go. 15% full. That's okay. Alright, so we built a new... Can they get here? Yes, they can. So what... Oh, there they go. They're moving in. Sometimes a little patience goes a long way. What they don't have is water or power, but power isn't that far away, luckily. What we can do is just build a straight pipe there. 1200, that's fine. Build an, another straight pipe here. And I know that's a little overlap, but hey, that's okay. Better have overlap than underlap. The other thing we want to do is maybe branch off. We could just power right there, that would be nice. Particularly, power lines are so expensive. Hopefully, they got it. There we go. Power is there, and they're moving in. We got a shot here. So now when these people move in, they can only go left. They enter the loop. They can get to Herschel's farm. This is not good, though. We have to maybe... Got to have something to loop back to the main road. Whoa. What's going on with the garbage? that out of here. 11 out of 19 trucks being used. Hmm. Well, we currently have a garbage issue. Let's see if this, how this plays out. These guys don't really have a... Can you go out this way? Yeah, they can go back down this way. That's what you could do. I wish there was a way to, like... Ooh. They have to go out of the city, and once you get on the loop, there's no coming back in. So let's see if we can... Can we do, like, a on-ramp maneuver there? If we were to do this... That's okay. I'm okay with that. Then there's going to be a huge traffic jam. That's so hard. But there's got to be... We, we've got to find a loop back into the city. Because once you're here, it's over. Where could they ideally... See, we don't want to dump them here. That's going to be another major traffic jam. Let's see where we can dump them off at. 
traffic jam there. Where is there not a traffic jam? That we want to essentially create a traffic jam. Um, that's tough. Because whatever we do, we're, we've got some issues. Unless... No. That's the only answer for right now. Let's just see what happens. I don't, this is purely experimental, but... How much is that going to cost us? Is that connected? All right, we'll see what happens here, boys. Oh. I probably should have put... Eh, that's fine. That could be a good move. You want to get back on? You can get back on. We still have a long way to go, but that's okay. Ooh, that's getting nasty right there. Ooh, we're losing money. Well, why are we losing money here? These people don't... Why are these guys so needy? You have power. So if you're a truck coming here, you go get your stuff. You come up, you gotta go all the way back around. Okay, I see. Or is that, this is one way, right? It is. So we need a, we'll do a one more quick line. Maybe, how about a two laner? From there to there. How much money is that? Space already occupied. All right, let's do a curved road. Maybe that'll work for us. Distance too short. Um, we can get rid of it. Well, first off, let's get rid of this. I don't like how you can't build around power lines. Like That's kind of malarcus. But either way, demolish abandoned demolish burn. That's fine. Do what you do. All right, we're going to have to get rid of that home. What if we just put a one-way right there? All right, we'll see what happens. That just got real sticky. <laughs> Either way, we're giving it the old college try. I want to say if we were to rate that episode, probably took a little shot to the face, but that's okay. Doesn't mean we can't bounce back. We are going to have to raise taxes in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, I encourage you to hit the like button. Hitting the like button helps support the video, helps support the channel, helps support your face. Support our ability to try to make this traffic situation work in our favor. We can clear that up. It's not a, it's not a game ender. I'll see you guys next time.